All right, Universal Liberty Geckos, men and women, boys and girls, how you all are doing? I hope you all are having a great afternoon, great morning, great evening, great day, depending on where you all live in and where you all are from. And as you all can see right now, I'm here at uh, Peco looking at some food for my Liberty Geckos. I've been coming here for a while, actually, too, like back to back lately with uh, Peco and they they ain't been having no wax worms in lately see that's what i'm really trying to come across because my mealworms and beetles they doing so good um right now uh back at home my mealworms and uh, beetles they are doing good back at home like they they doing they doing good for now i gotta get ready to feed them soon too i gotta get ready to feed the uh the beetles and the mealworms again that i got at home that i'm feeding I've been coming to Petco later just to get some wax worms. They said they got some creakers, so I need to hurry up and get up there and ask for some creakers before they creakers get bought all out. Hopefully not, because I'm back here trying to like see like did they have any super worms back here? Nah, I mean not super worms, but wax worms. And now that I know that they don't have any wax worms back here, uh, I might as well just go go up there and get them creakers, because I really need some creakers for my little gecko. Like like I said. I think uh, eating the mealworms for them right now, they just, they, they basically like, eh, time to mix it up. And like I said, I've been coming here back and forth looking for some wax worms. Because they love wax worms. They love them little juicy, little good loaded wax worms. Like my leopard geckos, they love them. They love them wax worms. Like, they love them, man. I've been coming here back to back lately, but they ain't been seeing no wax worms. Like, they been low on a lot of stuff lately and like a lot of customers been buying them now too though like this is why like since i've been coming here i noticed that too lately like a lot of um a lot of other pet owners like reptile owners they've been coming here like buying uh the food out for uh the leopard geckos i've been noticing that lately so with all that being said uh, wait wait a minute they got some waste wine sitting up here this where they sit them in now? I gotta be careful how open this too, y'all. Because uh when they turn into mouth. Oh, this one look bad. This one is not looking too good. So nope. This waste worm contain then them dead waste worms. They stink. Oh, they smell them dead waste worms. I promise they stink. So yeah, I think they all store use. I think these are store use too, that's why they got that little yellow bark about them. Uh, get some live ones in here. They just stink. <laughs> Y'all don't know that look, that little sour look, that little sour look, little ick smell. Like, uh. oh, definitely not. I mean, they could be alive. I don't know. They could be in the bottom. I don't really want to dig and tell, but they could be alive down there. They could like just. It could be some li yeah, dog, yep, I see some moving, so it is some live ones in here. They just little. So I definitely need to pay more attention. These two mealworms contain I'm getting them. For breeding purposes though, like I'm getting these two mealworm cases for breeding purposes. The mealworms in there and they hundred large counts, they just down at the bottom. So I definitely need to be careful with the uh worms, like um Cause I look at them, as y'all can see, it's on me, so I heard Universal Leopard Geckos. And just to let y'all know why I've been so long and why it's been like so long since y'all heard me, I've just been like busy trying to be like stable. Like stable and like just like in a well sat and comfortable position. It's been hard lately because like some people say like don't ever get too comfortable with something like yeah i i see why most people like say that and, like when they be sitting there like oh it's a mouse inside here the reflex it is some flying mouse and i do not want to let these mouse go but it is some mouse inside here oh the reflex i closed their top so fast universal leopard geckos man i don't know if y'all see the mouse the mouse are definitely in there like crawling around they try to fly out when I open it, like, and this is exactly why I do not want to breed wax worms. This, this is exactly why I do not want to breed them. Like, exactly why. that is the reason why I do not want to breed them right there. 
Man, the reflexes though, the reflexes from the boy. I slam that top so doggone fast. Had to. So it's it's on I me mean, here. It's it's on I me mean, here. Bad a lot of dead ones in there too. A lot of ones that went bad in there too. And there's some ones inside here. Uh, it's on the side there too. But like I'm looking for like them little fat, like little juices, like healthy and shape. Okay. Okay, this one, this one right here stink too bad. Don't see me some on the side here. Uh, some little good size ones inside here. And they be the thing with the waist around. Like, you be have to offer them right up on the spot. Like, when she buy them, you got to offer them up right there on the spot. Because, like, for real, like, I said, these things turn into mouths real fast. They turn into mouths real fast. So, like, if y'all buy wax worms for y'all leopard geckos, like, trust me. I don't know anybody else will tell y'all universal leopard geckos, but trust me, you all. Like, when you buy wax worms for your leopard geckos, it best you go ahead and just, like, feed them wax worms, like, right off. Just, you, like, you just go and feed them right off. At least you, like, want to have a mouse flying around, and you want to, like, feed and breed the mouse. Then other than it, yeah, like it'd be best off if you go on here and just uh just like feed them all off like right away. Cause like the waste worms they turn into mouse real fast. And that's the only thing about breeding them. That's why I don't want to like try to breed waste worms right there because I don't want no mouse flying around the house. Yeah. Other than that, like super worms, I'm giving them a try with breeding them. And I'm already like going good and decent right now with uh with uh wax worms i'm already like i'm already doing good with them so uh yeah they say if i be super worms inside here but this a wax worm container yep definitely wax worms so the second to the land that i just grabbed i don't know i might pick the first one back they don't look that good inside the second one though. They moving around, but they. Uh, let me see. They. It's some um, moving around in here, but they they still like they just took them out the freezer though. Like they barely like crawling around. I don't want them on either with all the dead ones in there though, but that's one that one got like a lot of like good decent sized ones inside there too. Forget it. I'll clean them up. I'ma I'm gonna get them all like in the feeding. Uh anyway. So I probably get some crickets. And um I might I might just get this Leo. I'm thinking it's a male. I'm thinking this Leo is a male. It's the only um Leo inside here. And they said this Leo uh been been brought back. Uh Universal Leopard Geckos. So like um they said like this Leo um it was on um, return and like well um you can't ever like know what people are going through at least you like really know what people are going through and why they will return they reptile or they reptiles to a pastor or to the previous owner like you won't you will not ever know what a person or people are going through unless you really know what they are going through like unless you like really like find that or get the words from them and like unless you really like see it yourself because sometimes words can just be words like rumors sometimes that's all they can be and you will not ever know what a person is going through unless you like really know like you see it for yourself they're just like seeing is believing so like uh they say that this leo was returned it seemed like a cool like laid back leo i want to see like if they're gonna open the tank and like if i'm gonna be able to hold i want to like go off like like handling the experience and see how it's gonna act like if i try to like hold it and um and touch it and play with it. i want to see how, how it's gonna act like right off and any any leopard gecko can be like um like I, I don't I don't know I don't know the word that I'm looking for universal leopard gecko like any leopard gecko can be like uh I'll just like reached out to like any leopard gecko can be like uh can be like I I just say tame I, I just say tame any any like aggressive leopard gecko can be like 
time only thing you gotta do like just put the time into like burning with that gecko and like chilling with it like get that gecko used to your smell used to your scent like used to your voice like all my leopard geckos they know my smell they know my voice i be loud real loud inside my room i be playing like video games inside my rooms i be playing like online mobile games inside my room and other type of like bunch of games i'm a i'm a game geek so i be playing a lot of like video games inside my rooms and i be so loud and my leopard gecko they 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 just used to it they they sleep through it they eat through it they drink their water through it they just sit there like be lazy through it my leopard gecko they used to my like loud annoying voice like honestly so um i want i want to know because it looked like a male when i first looked at it earlier when i came in here so i'm gonna see if it's a male or not and i might try to uh get it but like i said i need to go up there and get some crickets real fast like right now i will see y'all in the next video universe leopard geckos and we are done